What's going on guys, it's Craft Battle of Duty back with another episode of Single Player Pixelmon. Now I've recently started to bring this series back and I did enjoy the last episode and I hope you guys d Oh! Oh, straight out the bat, a yellow boss Vulpix. Alright, well let's uh, let's uh, just uh, take this on while we get through the rest of our intro. So yeah guys, today our goal is to get Matang up to a Metagross, so that's what we're going to try and do. Um, try and catch as many starters as we can as well. I'm um, just trying to think. Yeah, I'll use Snowflake. Hopefully it doesn't... Yeah, okay. I'm just hoping that uh, this guy doesn't try to... Um... Holy crap, he's 113. Yet a Blizzard still GG'd most of him, so... Oh, Vulpix is frozen. There we go. Come on, Moonstone. That's cringeworthy. That... Oh, we got the GLG Tickler! Oh, no way! Oh, if you guys don't watch my other series... And you won't know what that is at all. That is the GLG Tickler. I'm going to go rename it that. And I'm going to throw some trash TMs out the top here. Lots and lots of trash. I'll tell you that now. Um, sludge Bomb. Get rid of that. Let me see if Matang can learn Psychic. Oh, he can. Sweet. Um, we'll get rid of... Because he's a physical. So I don't want to get rid of Zen Headbutt just like that. Um... Hmm, we'll get rid of takedown. That's not too helpful. Um, and we do have a spare super potion, so... I don't know. No, I won't waste it, because I want to go heal him. Um, so let's... Oh, get back in my little Pokeball slot, you little cheeky. Um, so yeah, guys, I did start bringing this back. I brought back episode 44 the other day, and I really did enjoy playing it. So hopefully you guys are enjoying this series as well. Bringing it back to the old school days. This is a pretty old series, I guess. It's been running for a while now, so... I enjoy it and I hope you guys do too. But anyways, there's Giraffe over there. Um, so pretty much in this series, we just try to like pretty much just test stuff for like when we battle people online and stuff like that. Test out new strategies. Uh, try to like the main goal of the series is to try and catch them all. Obviously, we were really close last update, like before the update. We were really close in putting them all on the Pokedex. But it got um, harder. The only there was a couple hiccups. Uh, one hiccup being that I couldn't actively get uh, I couldn't get the um, the, the trade evos was one, and moonstone was another. That was another problem. These three right here, all moonstones, um, and the other problem was Porygon, all unobtainable. Like you can't obtain them. I actually haven't caught Mew that Mew yet either. Um, so we have Cyndaquil to train up as well. We also have Matang. Um, I think we might actually leave Metagross. Uh, well, we'll train him this episode at least, but like he probably won't be the main goal of this episode. Um, let's get rid of the. Oh no, let's get rid of this. No, let's no, let's, let's actually get rid of the Charizard. <laughs> um, and we'll give ourselves that Cyndaquil. Let's let's level up that Cyndaquil, guys. Let's get that nice little Cyndaquil up. Where is he? There he is. Okay, so yeah, we'll get we'll get him up to a Typhlosion, I think, this episode, because he's pretty easy to level up. Um, so there's a Rhyhorn over there. Literally, a Rhydon is enough to do it. Rhyhorn, sorry. It's enough to do it. Oh, now I have to go back inside to to rest as well, then. Alright, let's quickly take this guy down. Ice Beam! And poof! Cyndaquil. He evolves early, if I remember correctly. Yep, there we go. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Cyndaquil is evolving! Let's go Quilava! So I actually have a Typhlosion on my adventure series, I think. I'm not too sure. I would like to hunt down a Chikorita. I haven't I haven't found a Chikorita, a Mudkip, and a Primplop. Now I heard Primplop aren't that hard to find. So why don't we go? Well, well actually, it'd be cool to get all the second Oh, there's a Rachu over there. It looks so cool. I don't want to look at it though too much because I want to get one of them for my uh, for my uh, something different series. Oh, my, uh, my Pokeball series. So let's go to bed, and I, well, we can easily catch Primplop, because I heard he's not too, um, rare in the Ice Plains biome. Um, there's also Mudkip. Actually, let's look for a Mudkip in the Swamp biome. I haven't found one of them yet. Apparently, Mudkip spawns in the Swamp biome, and quite easily as well, so. Let's see what they've done here with that. That's gonna be pretty cool to find, if he's in here somewhere. Let's try and, Oh, let's at least train. There's a layer on over there. He'll be good XP. Yes, yeah, so let's just try and find a Mudkip. Um, oh, 58. Ho, 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 ho. 
cool lava. We're gonna get some XP here. Um, let's go Snowflake and Blizzard. Assuming he doesn't one bang me. Damn, that was a pretty big hit. There we go. Cool lava. Getting all the levels. Go 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 go. Oh, still going. Twenty five. Damn, I wish he had a lucky egg. He would have gone to like twenty eight. Um, so yeah, we gotta look out for that little, that little blue thing that is a mudkip. We gotta look out for him because he's in here somewhere. Um, we've actually been here like on and off quite a few times, but we never actually found ourselves a mudkip. Oh, there's a tangler. That's forty nine. God, they really did change some levels this update. That is ridiculously high. Let's still take him on though. I don't think he'll be too much good XP, uh, considering that he's Tangler. Oh, still a fair amount. Oh wow, four and a half thousand. That's good XP. That's that is good XP, ladies and gentlemen. That looks like a boss eyeball. I see. I didn't actually notice that that Bulpix at the start was a boss because I'm wearing Gunners, and like it gives it has like an orangish tint to it. Let's first that Slowbro. He's a high level as well. So it was like. Is is that a vault? Is that a boss? Okay, I didn't see it until I saw the yellow name tag. Uh, I think Blizzard is still better than Gust. Oh no, works for me. Let's go Ice Beam and da da da. Cool Lava 31. Oh, what's going on here? Coughing. Let's switch to Matang. Oh god, I love Matang's model. So good. I hear balls at level 50 or 55. So we'll we will find that out when that happens. <laughs> um, let's continue looking for that Mudkip. Two Haunters over there. Haunters look sick this update. So awesome. Uh, what's that? Kakuna. Nice little wild Kakunas in the wild. That reminds me of when I first... That Kakuna, I don't know why, just re like reminded me of the first time I ever played Pixelmon. And I was just like, whoa. Because I spawned in a forest biome, and it was just like Caterpies and Metapods and stuff walking around. I was like, whoa. This is so cool. But uh, I don't know why. Just little flashbacks like that. Um, <laughs> so I think we might hit up a different biome. These are this Mudkip. He's not much of a spawner in the old, uh, the old, the old Swampland biomes. He's not, he's not coming out, is he? Um, let's just get, do another. Oh, and Poliwhirl got a different tint. I don't know if I've already mentioned that in another episode, but he's got a little bit of a different tint this, uh, this update. Um, let's a chop. Okay, let's let's give this one the flick, but uh, yeah, we'll give this one the flick. The old mud kippers. He's not. He doesn't look like he's coming. The old mud kippers. So we're gonna go up oh, and jump and jump and jump. Two little pony tars. How are we? Um, let's get let's get our typhlosion. Yeah, let's get our typhlosion, and then I think we might go in and look for. Oh, we'll, we'll do it at the same time. We'll look for a uh, the old chikoritas while we're in here anyway. So it's chikoritas and trico and the tricos. Okay, so this will be enough to level us up. Get the good old snowflake out. Hit him up with an ice beam, and then we're good. There we go. Oh, no way. One more. He needs one more. Hmm. We can do that. Oh, 49. 48 Persian. God, these levels are high. Um, I did have, like, a lot of complaints from people that were first joining the server. They couldn't find a, like, a, a, a low enough level Pokemon to start. Now that's I'm just gonna give some tips out to the um, to people. If you are trying to start out playing Pixelmon for the first time, and you because you're spawning with a level five, there's two strategies you can go about. You can start um, learning how to craft rare candies, which is sort of no. You need to go the Nether and or hunt Pikachu, so that's not really an option. Um, so what I would suggest is that you go to a forest biome. Now a forest biome like has Caterpies and Kakunas and Metapods and Weedles that are really low level and then it works its way up to Volpix. That's why for most of the servers I try to- st Oh! Chikorita! Yes, 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 yes! Yes, Chikorita! We found a Chikorita! Chika, 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 Chikorita! I honestly want to Master Ball it. No, we got- we, No, I'm gonna Master Ball it, Chikorita. What am I kidding? Okay, let's get a, uh, let's get a, uh, a Typhlosion first before we catch Chikorita. Hopefully this is enough. Oh, it's not enough. Alright, let's catch him. Let's do this, Slasher. Give him the falsest of swipes. That did not make any sense. <laughs> okay, there we go. He's false swiped. Um, yeah, I'm still going to paralyze him because just starters in general are a bitch to catch, guys. They're so annoying. Um, they have a high catch rate. It's crazy. Um, and we will go with a... 
We can go with a net ball, even though I'm pretty sure that applies to bug and water Pokemon, so that's not going to do too much. Um, we'll, we'll see. I don't have any Pokeballs to actually use. I will use a Master Ball if I have to, because there's not many uh, hard-to-catch Pokemon that I need. Uh, let's try a Heal Ball. I really need to whip up some Ultra Balls, to be honest. That really needs to happen, like, soon. Okay. This isn't looking good, guys. I'm going to use them all, but, like, if I have to use a Master Ball, I'll use it, because it's worth the effort. I mean, I have two, and I only... I don't even need one. I can catch Mew legit with Ultra Balls. Not that hard. We're set up with Scyther and stuff like that. It's easy. Okay, it's ticking, it's ticking, and we caught him. There we go, guys. We got a Chikorita. That was the one that was sort of scaring me the most. That's, I guess we still got Trico. Um, just forest spawns in general, just because I've had a hard time with Bulbasaur, just like almost all the time, that uh, it just scares me. So if we could go out and find ourselves a Totodile this episode, that would be sick. I, I would love to find ourselves a Totodile this episode and try to get like Croconaw, um, try to get ourselves a Croconaw, a, and a Bayleaf, and, oh, we already got the cool lava. Cyndaquil's easy to find though. He's, he's so easy to find. It's ridiculous. You can just see Cyndaquil's plastered all over that biome. That is the extreme hills. Um, nothing, no shinies, not all good, all good. Let's go. Um, Oh, actually, because I remember once I was like, damn, I need to update and put Ray's minimap in. Ah, uh, fun fact, Ray's minimap isn't updated to 164. How's that? I I was just like, what? I, I thought it was updated. It's been a while, and they still haven't even updated. I mean, we're on a 17. So, I don't know what's going on with Ray's minimap, but uh, that's just a little update. Um, now, I'm going to go to the Mew Outpost. Not trying to catch Mew. Oh, no. Actually, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to try and... Put some items away and then get some Pokeballs out because we need some Pokeballs. Um, so, get rid of that. Um, in here. Uh, put these away. Oh, the GLG Tickler. I'll take that. And what I'm going to do with you is... No, that's where's, my, where's my legit anvil? There it is. Um, we're going to call this one the GLG Tickler. There we go. Totally worth seven levels. Totally. So, if you guys don't know what the GLG Tickler is, it's pretty much a thing where um, it's like a drop Ryan got on the G on the survival server. And like, like, but when we got it, I found like back to back shinies, like back to back wild shiny Pokemon. So like, it's it's legit, and I want to keep it there as like a, it's like a good luck charm, pretty much is what it is. It's uh, it's it's good luck charm, and it works. Back to back shinies. I'm pretty sure. Not many people have done that, so... And if they have, they're probably cheated. <laughs> I don't know, it's just... There's some... No, no one cheats on YouTube, really, apart from a couple people. Like, the shiny Mew dude, that's totally not legit. Um, but, yeah. I mean, yeah, it's pretty good. I uh, I wouldn't consider anyone really cheating. But, uh, anyway... Apart from the Mew. <laughs> um, Charlie, the rich Charlie. What are you doing here, Mr. Charlie? I'm gonna beat you up. Nah, I'm. Oh, I was gonna put, put, uh, I meant to grab the chikoritas out and get the bay leaves. And. Yeah. Get the chikoritas. Okay, get the. Get. Get. Get, get the chikoritas. Wow, he looks weird. And then go to the Mew place. This one. And what we are supposed to find is. Because I did find this off screen once. I found a Totodile just chilling. Over here, so we got some polywags. That's sort of what we want, not really. I mean, they're river spawns. Yeah, I'm getting nothing but river spawns here, which is good. We got a nice little. There was a venom off there. There was a psyduck here a second ago. Yeah, there he is. Um, venom off. Come on, baby, spawn me a toad tail. Toad tail. Toad tail. Let's do it, please. Another polywag. A lot of polywags. Oh, polywags. Whoa, Chikorita has one health. Synthesis. <laughs> Oh, he got bitch slapped. <laughs> okay, um, that's not gonna work. <laughs> uh, psychic. And we have healers, I believe so, in my little outpost here. So let's go in my house. And not close the door on myself. And we do not have a healer, so what we have to do is go back here. Use these healers. Dun, 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 dun. No, it takes a little longer. It takes a little bit longer. And... 
up, 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 up. We're out, okay. And then we go to the burnt new jungle. And then we go back out. And then we go back in here. And then we go to bed. Because it's night time. Almost night time. Oh, there's a magma over there. Come on, let me go to bed, please. And bedtime. Nope. It's not going to let us go to bed. Let's go. Let me go to bed. There we go. I had to type A <laughs> to go to bed. All right. And let's get ourselves our Chikorita up to a bay leaf. Let's do it. Let's do this. Um, why no Pokemans? Why you no give me Pokemans? I want Pokemans. And I want the Totodiles. Please. I really want the Totodiles. Oh, 49 Magma. Let's roll. Switch to the Snowflake, who's still going to Blizzard you and one bang you. There we go. Chikorita is going to evolve, everybody. Let's do it. Here we go. Here we go. Here's the Chikorita. Chikorita. Do, 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 do. I don't know what that was. <laughs> Come on, evolve. Here we go. Do. It's evolving. Give me that bay leaves. And there we go. Bay leaf for days. Oh, he's sexy. Oh, he is a big one. What size are you? Stats. He is enormous. Oh, we got the biggest one. That looks like a yellow boss. That looks like a yellow boss dog trio. That looks like... I, I'm going to take my gunners off. Yeah, that is definitely... That was huge, this diglet. Look at the size of this dog trio. Holy crap. Look at this one, and then look at that. Oh my god. It, like, that one is like... Oh my god. This small... It, how big it is amazes me. What was a flag on over there? Oh, I want a flag on. Alright, let's uh, let's get some XP on the Beldums, to be honest. Let's see what level this... I oh, will one bang with uh, Blizzard anyway. Oh, whoops. Uh, let's go. Okay. Get the Snowflake out. Magnitude had no effect, but a Blizzard's gonna GG so hard. Bang. What are our loots? Not all that. Oh, he's getting so many levels. Oh, we got a wide... Oh my god, guys. We got yet another Master Ball. Wow, guys. Wow. That's, uh... That's pretty funny. That's that's quite hilarious, to be honest. We now have three Master Balls. You just can't get rid of them. Um, oh, no wonder... No wonder... The, um... No wonder the uh, the blizzards were doing so much on Pokemon. It had a choice specs on. That explains a lot of things, to be honest. That does explain a lot. Because, like, it was hitting ridiculously hard. I was going to put wide lens on it, but there's no point now. I'll just keep the choice specs on him. Uh, we'll keep the wide lens, which is a new Pixelmon held item, if you guys didn't know. Um, pretty much just, uh, just allows you to... That's the GLG Tickler coming in right there. We, we had the GLG Tickler held, and we found ourselves a yellow boss. Two yellow bosses this episode, I must add, as well. Which is uh, not, not, not ordinary at all. Definitely not. Um, so, that's the GLG Tickler coming into play. No shinies. A Chikorita, which is also a good pull. Um, oh, I thought it was a red boss Nummel over there. But it was just a Nummel hitting himself. Um, so, let's get back to the river. Croc Rocks having a swack. Oh, I don't want to be a part of the fight. Especially because this guy can't really pull much of his weight. Oh, it takes a couple turns. Alright, there we go. We're out. Um, that's a weird looking Voltorb. That's a weird looking Voltorb. A big Lunatone. A beached Goldeen. Um, <laughs> a beached Goldeen. Uh, let's see what we got over here. A couple Magic Cups. Having a little swim. Uh, come on, Totodile. Give me the Totodiles, please. Please give me Totodiles. I want turtle dolls. Ah, oh, these polywags are trolls. Ugh, I'm switching on that one. Ain't no way I'm paying that. All right, let's go out of here and give him a pursuit. Should get him one bank. No, damn it. One more, and he's out. Bye bye. Um, so polywags for days. No, no, I'm. Uh... Come on, GLG tickler. Give it to me. Give me to the total. Get, give me to the total. Get me that total. Oh, come on. I, I don't want to just. Oh, an execute. They're pretty rare. Dang it. Oh, 
I already got one though. And an executor. Um, come on, GLG Tickler. I'm gonna throw I'm gonna do a 360, throw my GLG Tickler on the bridge, and a total is gonna spawn over there. And ready, wait for it. Um, I <laughs> I should have like cut the screen and just spawned a total all over there just for the troll. <laughs> um, so that total all though. That total all though. I honestly do not want to end this episode until I find a total all. Like that's just how I'm I'm at, at this point. Is that over here? Oh, more polywags. Come on, you waggers. Give me a freaking turtle owl. I want turtles. I really do want a turtle owl because then I can get like the three in the thumbnail. That's all I really. That's the reason I want it. I want to have Crocodile in the thumbnail so it'd be all like cool and stuff. But they're just not letting it happen, to be honest. They're just being a little bit difficult. A little bit. A little bit. A lot of difficult. Um. Maybe I should go to a different river biome. Where did I find Squirtle originally? Um, I'm just trying to think. I picked Squirtle as a starter, so it's it's not as uh, just straightforward as that. Um, man, writing is so slow on this update. All I know is that I found a total isle over there, and I should probably stay around there, but I'm not. Um, God, we can force a lot of spawns with this, I'll tell you now. I'm going to have to go F5 mode. I can't really see much. It's a Vibrava. Just keep an eye on these desert spawns, guys. Might be a shiny. A shiny lurking about or a boss. Okay, so I just spawned a lot of Pokemon. There's a Flygon. Oh. Alright, let's get some XP actually on the old the old bay leafers. Switch to the snowflakers. And we'll hit it up with an ice beamer. <laughs> there we go. Natural gift. The user draws power to attack by using its hell elbow. The very determined. That's why it natural gifted nothing in all those battles. That's why. Okay, so yeah, let's get back on the Snowflake Express. And just keep running forth and back from the jungle into here to try and get ourselves a a good old uh good old toady. Good old toady. So there we go. Then we run back out. Look at this flying though, dudes. I think you guys need to leave some appreciation in the comments and the, the ratings for that flying skills, man. Look, I'm just flying along the coast here, doing drifts and all. I can't wait for Lugia to be added. Like the first, there's another flag going over there. But like the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to like, no, no, I'm not even going to tell you. I'm not even going to tell you. Not, no, shh, shh, didn't hear anything. <laughs> um, whoa, whoa, guys, the GLG Tickler is in full force today. Three yellow boss Pokemon. Get it? Yellow gold GLG Tickler. Three yellow boss Pokemon. It's a sign. It's a sign, guys. Pay attention. That's all I'm going to say. You find yourself a GLG Tickler. You're gonna have loots for days. That's just how it is. All right, Blizzard. What I win this time? Moonstone, please. Wow, eight TMs, elixir, and a luxury ball. That is just class. <laughs> okay, so I don't need that. Um, Smackdown, don't need that. Okay, so they're trash. What's this? That's trash. Um, I wish I was on a server so I could sell this stuff. Damn it. Trash, trash, uh, it's sort of useful, it's useful. Fire Blast is useful, Dragon Tail is useful, Reflex, trash. Double Rain Dance, which is double trash. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's 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 three yellow bosses. That's crazy, guys, in a row. That's like the lucky dip. I don't know, this has been a really great episode as far as like rarity-wise. We found three yellow bosses and a Chikorita. Chikorita ain't the easiest thing to find, I'll tell you now. It's not easy. Let's take on this Poliwell, to be honest. And give him a good old... Yeah, let's give him a Gust. Special attack should uh, give him a good run on his money. There we go. Bayleaf's now level 30. Hell yeah. Um, however, it still stands. Where the hell my Croconore be at? Croconore and or Totodile. I'll take either or. Or a Mudkipper? Any mudkippers around here? Let's... Yeah, any mudkippers around here? 
Uh, Bockers. Goldines. Goldines. No Mudkippers. No... No Mudkippers, no Croconoras. <sighs> it's a shame. It is a shame. I mean, we, this could have been a... Uh, oh, no, it already has been a killer episode, I'm not going to lie. I mean, three yellow boss Pokemon is just... Oh, there's a Dratini down there. And Diamond Extraction Squad. Go, 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 go. Wow. If that isn't karma, I don't know what is. I landed on the Dratini and killed myself. <laughs> oh my god. Did that really just happen? I landed on a Dratini and died. Oh my god. <laughs> Imagine if there was just a Croconaw or a Totodile just sitting right there. Like, as I died. Imagine that. And he's despawned now. Wow. That is a class dick move. Holy crap. I don't even believe that, guys. That's crazy. That is just... No, don't say it so. Don't say... It. What? Okay, guys. First off, are we living in the dinosaur age? Because this thing is just freaking... I need to take a screenshot and, like, send it to, like, big catch of the day because this is freaking huge. Four, count them, four yellow bosses this episode. GLG Tickler going once, going twice, $20 on eBay. I tell you what, this is the best thing that's ever happened to Pixelmon, the GLG Tickler. It just, four yellow bosses in one freaking episode. I don't, I, I don't even believe it. I, I don't even just... Wow. I... <laughs> How big is it, though? It is freaking huge. It is just gigantic. It's like it's a dinosaur. It's like it's a T-Rex. Just... It's it's an anaconda, really. Just going through the jungle. All right, what do we get? Pretty trash loot rise. No, at, I can't believe out of these four yellow bosses, we did not score one Moonstone. That's... That's, an, that's just weird in itself. Um, so, Trash Loot Wise, Smackdown's trash. Home Claws is trash. Good, 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 good. Trash. Alright, two Power Braces somehow. Um, Volt Switch is trash. That's good. Empicade is trash. So, pretty much all we did was get a couple of Pokeballs out of that. But, man. I still can't get over the fact how big that Arbok was, man. He was just next level huge. Um... Now, I think we need to end this episode before I find another yellow boss. Like, they're just coming out, like, at once. Like, all those times I've been like, please give me a boss. I don't even want a boss at this stage. Like, I'm literally at the stage where all I want is a Croconaw or a Totodile. But all I get is four yellow bosses. Not complaining, but, like, that's just crazy, man. I, I honestly think something's up. Oh, there's a Beldum. I thought it was Totodile. This would be a good place to uh, find myself a Totodile. This little river bit here. Um, I still don't think it'll happen. Some nice seekings. I mean, this has been a good long episode. If you guys want long episodes like this, make sure to leave a like and I'll, uh, I'll make sure to make a couple more of these long ones for you. But damn, there's a couple of Beldrums, Lairons. Oh god, they're all coming out over here. Um, not coming out on the river though, but we want them. Beldum. Two Beldums. Ah, uh, God, this has been... I, I, I honestly just 100% cannot get over how big that freaking Arbok was. He was just... Huge is an understatement. He he was literally... Well, that adds to the tally, but it's not a... I sort of wish, just to keep things going, that it was a, a, a yellow boss. Just to keep things going. But this will still do. Let's see how much a Zen Headbutt does on this. Should do a bit. No, I didn't do as much as I wanted it to. Let's try Psychic. Uh, yeah, I reckon he could take it. Let's go Matang. Yeah, buddy. Matang is out for the count. Let's do this. What loots do we get? And This is interesting. An Everstone. I don't think I've had... No, I do have one of them. A Reflect, a Power Anklet, and an Orenberry. Alright, that's interesting at least. 
So that's five bosses for the count. I'm gonna put that away there. Um, then we need a bank, like hardcore. Oh, and there's another loot that I need to pick up. Let's put that on this guy so he doesn't miss a Zen headbutt because a Zen headbutt 100% accuracy, it is not. So that, that's good. That's that, that's a nice little addition there. Um, I need to get home though because it's really dark and I can't see very well. I, I could miss a yellow boss or, or a totodile at this stage. I really could. Like it could just skim right past me. Um, so let's do a Yui here at this river section and then let's follow the river back so make sure try and maximize our total our finding uh, chances what's what would it be like if I found a yellow boss total aisle because you can 100% not catch bosses these these days I'd probably just break down in, in tears to be honest unless it dropped me a moonstone that'd probably be good because I want to scratch these off my pokedex to be honest but uh Oh, there's a polywag. But that Ekans though. I mean that Arbok. Just huge. I almost wanted to capture it and have it as a pet. Like like in a cage. Not like in a Pokeball, in a cage. And come back and visit it until it despawned the next day. Because that would eventually happen. That's why I didn't do it. But um Couple Poliwhirls, Psyduck, Golduck. Ugh, okay. I guess. We will end the episode there. Uh, I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. Actually, wait, let's go to bed first before we do our outro. Because we need a nice little sunlight. Actually, we'll just do it here. There we go, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. If you guys did, make sure to leave a like for this crazy, crazy episode. Five total bosses, four of them being yellow, and a nice little Chikorita slash Bayleaf to go with the crew. Which is nice and cool. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like. Like I said before. Even though I'm just repeating myself. And I'll see you guys for the next episode. Later this week. See you guys then.